my friend Laura. Hi, Hi. Laura. How are you doing today? Good. How are you? I'm great. I'm great. I'm have you ever roasted anything? I have not. Oh, do you like roast chicken? I do. It's very yummy. Great. Well, we are going to learn some roasting techniques today that will work with all meats, beef, pork, chicken, lamb, whatever you like to roast. All right. Let's pop one in front of us right here. Okay. Now, before we do anything, we want to take a little piece of paper towel and just put it inside the cavity of the chicken like this and just dry it out a little bit. Okay? Uh-huh. And for a little bit of flavor, we're going to put in a sprig of fresh rosemary. Can't you also okay. put in like an orange or something? Yes, you could put in oranges, lemons, you could put other herbs in. Um, what that does, as the chicken's cooking, uh -huh. the flavor from the herbs or the fruit that you put in infuses into the chicken. What we've got to do now is we have to do something called truss the chicken. We're going to use string. You have a piece of string there. Can you use different string or only this You one? have to use string that has no nylon in it because okay. if there's nylon in the chicken, guess what? You put it in the oven, it's going to melt. And the chicken doesn't taste too good with melted nylon on it, okay? Yeah. So, we're going to wrap it round the little taily bit here at the end. Okay. Now, what you want to do, put your fingers on your drumsticks right like that, pull them up towards the chicken, wrap the string around like that. Okay, just around the end pieces. That's it. And then you're going to pull it up a little bit like you were pulling on the reins of a horse. Okay. Because then it pulls these drumsticks up towards the body to keep them nice and moist. And then we're going to go down between the breast and the drumsticks. All right, flip your chicken over. How are you doing? Good? Good? Flip him over like that. Come up here. By the wings, we're going to cross the string over like this. Okay. And we're going to turn him back again. But this time, we're going to catch the wings there like that and flip him over. All right? Uh -huh. And then we're going to tie the chicken up nice and securely. You can do a bow or a knot. It doesn't matter because you can cut this off afterwards. 